this is um, part two of the uh, piston modification. La -di -da -di -da that I'm doing for a friend. And um, basically, the whole um, point of this is my mate wants to. My mate's been messing around, and he wants to see. Um, He wants to see if we can um, really reduce the weight of uh, these pistons and to see to what extreme we can reduce the weight. So, uh, unfortunately, he doesn't have a mill and a lathe, etc. Um, so, that's why I'm doing it. But um, it's a good, in a sense, it's a bit like uh, window porting. These were the, uh, the uh, specs that he gave me that he wanted me to take out. Um, the other side's the same, so we're going with the porting window option first. See if this really detrimentally affects the strength of the piston, uh, piston temperature, and if, if it can run full stop. Um, what he's thinking about doing is, if this works, to possibly do the other side, maybe a different configuration. Um, but literally, it's, he's just trying to see how much we can hog out. That's as much as he wanted to hog out. And uh, it's pretty cool. I'd say the other side's quite simple. The uh, inside there... Focus, god damn it. There we go. See, the inside has missed all the bosses, etc. It's quite extensive, don't get me wrong. But... Um, that was cut with a what size is this? I can't remember. So this is a an M3 solid uh, carbide end mill. Um, I stuck it in the chuck foot because I don't have collets this small. Um, I don't think I do. Anyway, so uh, that's that, and um, it'll stick it in the engine. I'll see if I can get a video of it running if it runs. And uh, if he's successful, he wants to take it back out again and try and hog off some more. So we'll work out a way around that, etc. See what we can actually take off. Right then. So, um, like I say, we're uh, he's doing this um, weight test. I'm actually weighing them. Um, that's what it's all down to. His, like I say, it's his little project. He wants to mess around and do it. Um, his whole idea is that he's got a. Um, Oh, an Aprilia um, RC engine that he wants to uh, mess around with, but he's been building up this engine for absolutely ages, doing quite a few little mods. I'll see if I can get some videos of them. But he's wanted to try it out first with this little uh, Piaggio engine he has. Um, it's just a scoot that's been sat in his back garden. It's really just a running, like a bench testing engine. But. Uh, my opinion is, it's too weak, as is, I think, but, like I say, we'll see. In a sense, that's the whole point of, um, I wanted to round off these edges as well, but he said, no, don't worry about it. So, uh, it's a bit of a stress riser, isn't it? I did uh, touch all the corners off with a rat tail file, a little small Swiss one, but, um, yeah. One of the things that if this actually works, or if we actually come, he's got he's got about six of these pistons at the moment. Um, so we'll try this, and we'll do as much as we can to this. If just say this um, cut out here is far too high, we can reduce that, etc. We'll have another go with some other pistons. Um, see how it goes. And it's literally just to reduce the reciprocating mass. Uh, if this works, you know, like I said, this is my project. Um, but if this works, or we find a happy medium, um, this might be included in the derby. I might actually, when I buy the new pistons for it, etc., I might actually give it a go, hogging a bit out and see how it goes. You know, so, who's the thought?